Hey, what's going on? Welcome. If you are new here, welcome. Please subscribe, click the notification bell, share it all your social media. If you're returning, please do the same and welcome back. I believe that this person on the left is a banshee and I believe the banshee is Fatima. Let me explain. Fatima currently is pregnant with something. She was told she medically cannot have children. Fatima having relations with Ellis from the water they drink and the food they consume has put something inside of Fatima that has allowed her to be able to carry a child. So the child is uh, Fatima and Ellis. However, the child is going to be corrupted because of the water they drink and the food they eat from Fromville. And that child is going to eat on Fatima and Fatima is going to soon turn turn into this while she's pregnant. Instead of Fatima gaining weight like you normally see in a pregnancy, she's going to shrivel up like this. Look at Fatima's nose. Look at the Banshee's nose. Look at the mouth. Same mouth. Almost the same chin. Chin is kind of like tit for tat. The hair texture is the same. It's almost like the same symmetrical face that they both share. And Fatima is the only character that we've seen that likes that kimono dress, such as that. I don't think everything in Elgin's visions are the same, or I don't think everything in his prophetic dreams are necessarily the same. Like I think we're seeing the color orange because orange represents change in the town where things are gonna start getting worse because Victor was saying that the leaves are starting to become orange, they're starting to fall, which traditionally means that a season's going to change, which is gonna go into winter. They're losing their leaves. What? The trees. So? That happens every year. Well, not here. It's always the same here. Oh. Hmm. Is it bad that they're losing their leaves? When things change here, it's usually bad. Well, if it's never happened before, maybe it's good. So Victor's been there at least, at least 10 years. And so if nothing has changed in the 10 years that he's been there, except for when they had two vehicles come a while back, and now they had two vehicles come at the start of episode one and season one, I do believe that orange is somewhat symbolic of change that's going to be negative. Kind of like before you get to the red where stuff is horrible and there's like mass deletion, stuff is going to be appearing as orange. And I believe that's the reason why this kimono is orange instead of it being the colors that she normally wears with the stuff that she chooses to have on. And I believe that in Elgin's vision, Elgin was in the place of Ellis, Fatima wearing kind of like a kimono style overshirt. Christy and Marielle, they're spooning and Marielle mentions the music box. I think there was a music box. Orange orange foreshadowing that orange is going to be a color we see more often which is kind of like an escalation getting ready for things to be red the bath is being ran elgin is in the bathtub fully clothed a character being in a tub or a shower fully clothed in movies is a visual representation of their emotional state throughout the entire episode elgin has shown signs that he has anxiety, that he's worried, he's uneasy. And I think it's because he's taking on the emotions of other people. And so he's sitting in the tub and this is all a prophetic dream of what's to come. In this prophetic dream, he's seeking comfort with the water. And I think the only character that really would want to seek comfort would be Ellis because Ellis was stabbed and he's injured. And he said in, in the previous part of the episode that he has gotten used to he won't be comfortable in order to give him comfort with his injury he's being ran a bath that he's soaking in so this is elgin having the prophetic dream of what ellis is going to be doing in the future with fatima running him a bath he starts to sink into it in his dream exhaling so every time they see the music box, it means they are coming, like Martin was saying to Boyd. Because this is a dream, they must be the next level supernatural creatures. And in this one, we're gonna see Fatima. 
This is Fatima while pregnant with the from baby is pushing him under. She's really pushing Ellis under, but Elgin is having the dream that he's in Ellis's body. This right here is Fatima. This is her while she's being possessed and the baby has been eating on her. That's the reason why she looks like that. And I think it's one of those things like how the night creatures are where they look normal and then when they go to attack you, they have like a different form and their insides are being eaten by whatever is possessing them and making them like that. Because in the previous part of the episode, we had Christy, when she did the autopsy on the creature, on the smiley creature, she said their organs are human, but it's all been dried up like it's in a museum. So this is Fatima right now in the future with her body and organs and everything dried up like she's in a museum. And I think it's because of the from baby. <laughs> Now, I think the reason why we're hearing that eh, she's a banshee, but she can't really control herself. The eyes look like they're possessed. I think that's what it is. It's the food and the water that they're drinking in Fromville. It's affecting them. It affects their mood. It affects their thinking and it makes them do stuff. Someone or something else wants them to do as far as controlling them. But I do believe that the eyes are the same and this is definitely Fatima especially with the same nose same distinct nose the mouths are the same the same kind of hair and hair texture I mean the hair looks exact the resemblance of the two kimonos looks really really similar I think that is Fatima just kind of like possessed with the baby inside of her from Fromville it sounds like a banshee and the banshee's wearing a kimono associated with Japanese style whereas a banshee is associated with Ireland so the closest thing we have that's a banshee that's usually associated with being Irish and something wearing a kimono something associated with Japanese style is a Yanaki Baba. So Yanaki Baba is a yokai in the form of a crying old woman. She remains outside of the house, weeping loudly all night long. Although it appears that Yanaki Baba are sharing in the sadness of others, it is sometimes said that they actually weep out of scorn, mocking those who are truly sad. This is a mix between the Yanaki Baba and the Banshee, combined in the one that they did for what I believe Fatima is going to turn into. The weeping is associated with being sad because of what she's doing or will do. And it just comes across as sounding like that and her kind of looking like that because of the front baby in her stomach that I believe is medically now possible because of the water they're drinking, the food they're eating from Fromville that can allow stuff to happen that should normally happen. And it turns out to be sick and twisted. What do you think? Let me know in the comment section your thoughts. Thumbs up the video, share your social media, subscribe, click the notification bell. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Go forth, do the great things, and I'm out. Peace. The future's not ours to see. Kiss around, surround.